just last year, running to home was only a dream for this little softball player. It just got a hold to me. I, I didn't know what was going to happen. It just really scared me. And batting was also out of the question as Jalen Crawford's knees and legs began to swell. Then it got to where she couldn't walk. And so then that's whenever we started taking her to doctors and they ran all kind of blood tests. Jalen's dad, Josh, says one of the first diagnoses was lupus, an autoimmune disease that can kill. Probably the hardest, one of the worst weekends we've ever had in our lives. I mean, the whole weekend we did research after research after lupus and what in the world, and it just scared us to death. The nine-year-old said she couldn't do anything, let alone play softball. When I would try to um, get up, I would end up falling and I don't know how it, it just really hurt. It hurt badly. Because it was to where she couldn't run, she couldn't ride her bike, and she couldn't, um, the girls in the swim pool, they would jump off the ladder. She couldn't do that, you know, and it was a lot of stuff to where it was hard, you know, seeing her not be able to do the things she wanted to do. Rachel and Josh say it was rough until they found out Jalen had juvenile arthritis a disease that is curable with medicine. Within two weeks, she was back to where she was walking. Now Jalen is the star of the show, getting to hit the field this season with little to no help. It wasn't no question. I mean, she, no doubt in her mind, she wanted to play softball again. You know, so that's where we are. Now she's got high goals and and not turning back. And with dreams this high, there's nothing that can stop Jalen from shooting for the stars. I feel good and I'm planning on Play next year too. In Shelbyville, Michelle Reed, KTRE, East Texas News 9.